Hey guys, welcome back to some more AFK Arena. That is right, we are back with our Team Greyborn account. We have 158,000 diamond druids, which is kind of crazy, but we're gonna save those for Tuesday because we know uh, Lady Simona will be up on Tuesday for the Greyborn, but we wanna continue in here, and I did not wanna miss my um, time emblems, and I did not miss the opportunity to go ahead and get that awakened version of Shmira. Now, of course, with this one, guys, they did give us our chest. So back with the faction accounts, there is the unlock of Shamira. I'm gonna try to get her all the way to that ascended version, meaning we're gonna be able to build her out at a discount. And I'm hoping, fingers crossed guys, that we do get some really good luck with the summons. Now on the YouTube account, of course the luck wasn't that great, but I'm hoping in here with the summons and the free copy we got right there, that we're gonna build them. Now we have a ton of stones on here. I'm gonna go ahead and pop these out again, hoping that we get some awakened heroes, Boom, what do we get out of here, guys? It is Naruko. Now, of course, within the Greyborn, um, we're not building up, but there are no Awakened Heroes. This is what happens with these stones. We have double copies of Alero, which is pretty sad. But overall, with the stones not seeing a ton of effectiveness, um, when it comes to the Awakened Heroes, the rarity to find one is kind of crazy rare that we're seeing out of here. But I have 755 emblems out of here, guys. So again, I am hoping, and I'm gonna pull up my calculator because I just want to... Um, to jot it down really quick with how many we have in here that we know we know exactly how many we are going to be using and where we're at so we're going to start at the 755 let's go ahead and do some summons so we have one copy we need two more to take her to legendary plus let's see our luck in here guys look at that second copy right there which does give us a copy very nice come on i want to see some doubles some back to back and I wish they would flag it for the diamonds. If we get the diamonds, I feel like a lot of times I'm just gonna pass right by this that we're not actually gonna pick up the diamonds or I'm not gonna see them. The second summons a little bit further away guys, but there it is. And it is just another single. So that is two, that takes her to legendary plus. Let's get three more. And then we will have, have her at mythic. Come on, one, two, three. Getting a ton of resources in here, four. That's 40 cards we're going through, 50, not a copy. 60 right there is gonna yield us another copy, which is just another single. Two more and we will have her at Mythic. That way we can build out the signature item and really build her up. The so one, two, three, that's another 30 cards in. Four, and we're burning through these fast guys, five. And again, it is gonna be right at that six summons. So that is 60. This should be the pity. Boom, but just another single in there, guys. We need one more. We need one more to build her out. Again, there's another 10, 20. Getting a lot of the faction cards in there. There's 30. Again, we are not having any luck in here, guys. There it is. Can it be a double? One more single. So that should take her to Mythic. 497 left. So let's uh, minus out our 497 left. 258 cards. So that is the amount that it took us um, to get her up to Mythic. I mean, minus the free copy they gave us. So our cards would actually be quite a bit higher on that, that part um, just to get her up to Mythic. Now, 258 cards is what we've used so far. So yeah, that, that's pretty... um. Not the best rates. I mean, if you're talking, we got what, five copies out of that. So if we divide that by five, uh, that gives us 51 cards per copy that we got out of here. So again, not really th the best rates. Let's see if we can do this, guys. So we got 497 left. I'm gonna put my 497 in here. Let's see if we can get some better copies on the backside. One, two, three. Again, just some more resources out of there. Four, not a copy. We need six copies out of here. And there we go, guys. There it is. Can it be a double? Just another single. Come on. Can we get some back to back copies? It doesn't look like that either. Yeah, the Graveborns are giving a run for their money in this one. They're just burning through these cards like crazy. Wow, we had 497 cards. And again, just another single. Where's our double? Where's our back-to-back? -back? So 10, 20. 30 right there. 
40. And again, 51 was the average. Is it going to be another single? It is just another single. Wow. Yeah, not having the best luck on here, guys, with that awakened version of Shamira. That's what, another 30 cards in. Of course, most of the resources are all going to the mailbox in here. Yeah, I'm hoping we got enough cards to build her out of here. Again, is just another single, guys. 247 left. What does that give us? Three more copies in here. So that takes her to Mythic Plus. Of course, we have two copies. Or one, we need two copies. Two copies will allow us to build her out. 247 left. So again, right here, guys, minus our 247 left. We use 250 cards to get, what, three, four copies? Yeah, guys, that's right at our pity timer because we still need two more copies. That's 62. So our rates are getting worse with Shamira. Can we sum it up with what we have left, guys? We got 247, 247 cards left in here. We need two copies. Can we get the last two pretty quick? I mean, we are pushing right about that pity timer every time. I believe that's what, 40, 50, 60, okay, gives us a copy, just another single. So again, we're right there at 60 cards. We need one more, guys. One more copy and we will have her complete. That is three, four, and they're gonna do the same. Five isn't giving us a copy. Six gives us a copy. Just another single, guys. The 247, we got what? 127. And again, minus 127 divided by our two. So 60, 61, 62. So roughly 60 plus cards every pull that we pulled for Shamira. That is literally sitting right at the 60 to 65 on um, pity rate that we do get with the hero. Maybe the Stargazer will be a little bit better, but there is the Ascended version, guys. Now, of course, we're going to get some resources out of there. Once you have the hero ascended through the Temple of Time, you can actually swap, and I can drop her in here. We need three copies to add that star, and that is where we're going to stop at, guys. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we can get lucky with these Shamira copies very, very fast in here that we're not going to burn through a ton of these Stargazer cards. There's one, we need two more guys. Boom, back to back copies, very nice. We need the final copy of Shamira. Come on, we should have it before we get into our diamonds. Come on, we need one, one single copy. There it is. Okay, so pretty good in the Stargazer. Um, didn't burn through um, too many copies in there. Didn't burn through too many um, scrolls in there. But that does take her, boom, to that one star. Very nice. So there is the engraving. Now, I believe also we don't have Ivan. And again, the last time that we actually played this account, we have Ivan right there. We have two copies of Ivan right there. But that leaves us, I'm thinking, two copies shy of Ivan. So we are still two copies shy of Ivan. As much food as we have on this account, guys. Yeah, I, Ivan is short. So you know what? I'm going to go in here and I'm going to do the desired hero summons. Um, even here, guys, we, we get free summons in here. Again, because we haven't played this in a, in a while, it is the, the returning player benefits. So let's go ahead. Let's pick up those two copies of Ivan. We're getting them at a discounted in there, and there is one. Now, of course, the rest of it just goes back to the regular full cost. I was hoping maybe, maybe we'd get lucky with some uh, some copies in there. Again, food is pretty full. Let's go ahead and see, guys, if we can get another copy of Ivan. There it is. So I'm just going to keep them at Ascended right now. That way we can get the animated avatar frame. I want to save my other five, of course, for the new Greyborn hero that's going to be coming. 
up pretty soon. That way we can actually build that out, but that will give us our other copy of Ivan. And I wonder if Ivan might not even be in, I don't think he's even in the ship anymore. He might be out of the heroic ship at this point. Just, just kind of thinking about it, guys, but I think he might be out of the ship. Let's see. Uh, Jerome, I thought he was. So he is out of the ship. That's okay, guys, because we got Shamira here. There is the awakened version of Shamira. Let's go ahead and pop that in. I was looking here. Edwin was the last one that we got. And again, guys, we haven't played these accounts in a significant amount of time. It, it's been quite a while, but there we go. There is Shamira's animated avatar frame. So we picked that up. Let's build art a little bit, guys. And also drop her in the resonating crystal. But I believe at this point, we do have enough to build her up. Now from the pumpkin, you can look at the, the headpiece as well as her signature item. Those are the two parts that you do need to actually build her up with the eighth day or the final day of the pumpkin. And here we have 313, so we're going to actually be able to take her to a plus 30 signature item. It's going to give us, of course, a pretty decent rebate in there. There is the plus 30, so engraving. I think it's going to be about the same. There's our rapid strength. That is our 30. There is our 60. Boom. There we go, guys. There is our 80 for Shimira, which, of course, gives her the diamond or the, um, the shiny stars right up there with the engraving. Let's go ahead and pop her in the resonating crystal. There she is, guys. Very nice look at the build out. And again, we have a lot of we have a lot of stuff so we can actually build all these up. We can get her all of the tier four gear based on that. Let's see the furniture summons again. I think I'm going to wait. You know what? I'm going to wait for these just because, again, we have the new Greyborn that's coming up on Tuesday. I can actually hop over and we can do some of the Greyborn, um, some of those summons when she comes up on Tuesday. I wonder if I have red cards, which we do not, but we have 236,000 poke coins, guys. That is absolutely bonkers um, with the amount of poke coins that we have in there. So again, I'm going to save that because Tuesday we know that the new hero is coming up. So I'll open the room. We'll get them all set. We'll also get um, Lady Simona built up as well. And of course, item collection, I'm going to have to go back here and kind of save everything, pop open all of these chests, but very, very cool. Took us a lot of cards, guys. I mean, took us what? We had seven in some change, I think 760. So it took us roughly about 600 cards. But again, we spent about 60 cards um, per copy that we had of that Awakened version of Belinda. But all right, guys, so that'll do it for today's video. Let me know what you guys think. Graveborn account, of course. Checking it out, guys. Wanted to get the summons in here before we missed them, but let me know in the comments what you guys think. And as always, thank you guys for watching.